Hey everybody, this is Miguel Vargas here, TRX Training Center Manager, and we're here for another issue of Ask the Trainer. Today we've got a question from one of our members that wants to know how they can use a TRX suspension trainer for shrugs. Well, here's the deal. Shrugs are an old school exercise that have meant to be used for increasing shoulder strength and upper back. This is a great exercise for bodybuilders, but what really happens on the average user, you're gonna get your shoulders up, leaning forward, forcing that poor posture, and that's the last thing we want anyone to have. So today I've got three great exercises that are gonna help increase shoulder stability all while keeping those shoulders down and back. Why don't you come along with me and we're gonna get this rocking and rolling. So the first exercise is gonna be the TRX clock pull. TRX straps are gonna go up to mid lane. All right, now we're gonna have Steve fully extend his arms out, shoulder height, walk his feet into about a 45 degree angle. Right hand's gonna come into his chest, left arm's gonna go out fully extended. As you can see, he's got a great plank going on right now. Shoulders are down and back, really working on that shoulder stability. You'll also notice that his arms are going in two different directions. One arm's going fully extended, another one's coming into a nice tight row. This is gonna force kinesthetic awareness because your body's doing two things at the same time and you wanna keep the straps from sawing. And I think he's doing a great job right now. Keep it up. So the next exercise is gonna be the TRX swimmer's pull. Straps are gonna stay at mid length, but now we're gonna walk it in a little bit so our hands are down by our sides. Great, so with the palms facing down, we're gonna take an offset foot stance. Why don't you put the right foot in front of the left? Awesome. Now we're gonna slowly lower our body back in that plank position. All while keeping that plank position, you wanna drive back up with your hands, really firing the lats, shoulders down and back, and chest is out in front. A lot of times people tend to raise their shoulders, and that's not gonna help the shoulders at all in this exercise here. We really wanna focus on a nice tight core, going down, good, and driving back up with those lats. Picture a swimmer that's trying to finish their stroke. You really want to come all the way through on that. Next exercise is going to be the TRX push-up plus. So we're going to get the straps down to mid-calf. Great. Once he gets his toes in there, we're going to get him up in the plank position. So hands are going to be a little out past the shoulders. Nice plank position. Core is nice and tight. And we're going to lower down in push-up position. Now he's gonna drive up. Once he gets to the top, he's gonna to push his hands into the grounds away from his chest. This is gonna work shoulder stability through serratus anterior engagement. It's also a great way to work your shoulders and your core at the same time. Remember, we wanna drive that belly button into our back, into our spine, nice tight glutes, all while maintaining that plank position. Let's see one more, round it out. Awesome. Way to go. All right. Hey everybody, thanks for coming out to another episode of Ask the Trainer. I hope you found these exercises highly informative. Remember, if you've got any questions, comments, or concerns, feel free to come to our website and leave a line on the forum. Who knows, maybe you could be the next one we're talking about on our episode of Ask the Trainer. See you next month.